So I'm getting ready to go to my church and I just figured I'd show you this Echo Speed Feed, uh, what it's all about and how to use it. This is on my PAS 225 that I did the uh, plug mod, the EPA plug mod on it. Uh, so check out that video. Uh, really runs like a totally different machine now. But uh, anyway, with this head, what you want to do is if you'll see this arrow back here in this little point, you, you need to line it up with these eyelets. So just spin it around and then I'll show you. What I like to do is, uh, it takes about 20 feet and I'm using, for now, just 80 thousandths line. I got this for free with the dealer. Um, so it takes 20 feet, so I'll take off uh, three arm lengths. And so that's 18 feet. Um, and it's so easy to put more on, I don't worry about it. So, cut it off. Now, um, you're going to be putting this through once you're lined up. And then what you're going to need to do is find the end. So what I do is just run it all the way down. And then that's it. So I just hold it here. What you're looking to do is hold this with one hand and this top ring with the other. And just clockwise motion, spin it up. And for me, this is about perfect. Um, I run it without the uh, guard on it. Um, it allows me to uh, trim a lot easier, a lot better visibility, uh, have a little bit more line out. Um, one thing that I will show you is in order to trim, I leave it like this, obviously, um, but to edge, if you take this head and I flip mine upside down, it won't lock here. But if you have this locked down good enough, your attachment's still secured. And now what you can do, instead of having to turn the machine upside down and have a weird handle position, you can come in at your normal angle and now trim uh, an edge without having to really, you know, articulate in a weird way. But anyway, this was just a quick uh, little demonstration, not so much uh, a detailed review or anything like that, but uh, I will say that uh, this is my favorite head and only second to the, the steel. Um, that that head is, is super simple. Doesn't feed this way, but you can pre-spool spools have them on on hand uh, pop the cover and drop them in um, and you could do that with this as well but it's intended to be used this way and then of course you've just got the bump feed so i'll see you on the next one